Welcome to NCR Talks, Automation in Practice. In this episode, we talk about the latest robotic station for nailing furniture frames. Guests are Anna, a customer representative, and Marek, a technical expert from NCR. Let's see what automation looks like in real production conditions. Hi, Marek. Thanks for agreeing to the interview. After a few days of working with the new position, I have to say I am impressed. Our company is very happy with your implementation. But you know what? For our listeners, tell us again from the beginning how it works. Hi, Anna. Sure, with pleasure. This station is a revolution in the field of nailing frames. The heart is the Yaskawa GP180 robot on a 14-meter track. Our solution was designed for customers involved in the production of sofas, couches, beds, and other upholstered furniture. So the robot moves along the entire line, from table to table, doing its job? Exactly. Thanks to this, it can handle four independent stations with molds, each with the possibility of adjustment. After the nailing is done, the robot moves on and puts the finished elements in designated places. We have as many as four such zones, each dedicated to one table. So the full cycle, from inserting boards and blocks into the molds to the finished frame, happens automatically? That's right. The operator only places the components in the form. The robot does the rest, nailing and adding the finished frames to the pallets. What tools does this robot have? Because I've seen that it can handle different types of connectors like nails and staples quite well. It has three industrial staplers and a nailer on board. It selects them depending on the task, integrated in a way that allows automatic switching between them. It is not only convenient, but also a huge time saver. What about service? Do our operators need to be robotic specialists? No, that's the beauty of the solution. The whole thing is controlled by an intuitive touch panel with a clear user interface. Simply select the frame model from the list and the robot automatically adjusts everything. And it really works. After a short training, our people can handle it without a problem. Key topic, security. How does it look with this type of automation? The station is fully fenced. There are also light curtains and emergency stop systems. If someone approaches the robot, immediate reaction. After stopping, it is also possible to resume its work without any problems after removing the threat exactly at the place where the process was interrupted. We took care of every detail. And that moment when the robot puts away the finished frames, awesome. Thanks to the vacuum suction cups, the robot moves the elements from the mold directly to the storage place. No risk of damage, no physical effort for the human. And retooling. We have a lot of models. The molds are adjustable. You choose a model from the list. The system takes care of the rest, the molds are also equipped with safeguards to eliminate possible human errors. The whole process takes literally a few moments. How much do we actually gain in efficiency? In tests, efficiency increased several times compared to manual work. In addition, the quality of workmanship is repeatable and the risk of errors practically disappears. The robot also does not take breaks. What about maintenance and service? Yaskawa GP180 is a proven machine. It also has a diagnostic system. It reports inspections independently. And we from NCR provide full support, remote and local. So to sum up, we have automation, increased efficiency, better ergonomics, safety, and simple operation. Exactly. This position can truly revolutionize production, especially in companies with a high variability of models. This investment really pays off. We'd be happy to help with your next implementation. Thank you, Marek, for the information about NCR Solutions. During our short conversation, the robot managed to assemble and put away two complicated frames. Exactly, Anno. It took him less than four minutes. The efficiency is impressive. That's all for today on NCR Talks. You can find more information about our solutions on our website. Now let's watch together how the robot works while knocking down the remaining tables and hear you in the next episode.